Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Today we're going to be feeding some of our carnivorous creatures some live grubs. What we have here are some black soldier fly larvae, and they were sent to us by Grub Terra. And uh, so these little gross things, I know to most people they're disgusting, but Zazu is already literally just hopping around in circles. He is so excited. He can see him wiggling inside the plastic. And so he is, look at him. He's like, I want him. Give me, give me, give me, give me. <laughs> now, uh, Grub Terra sent us about a thousand of these things, and uh, we took the liberty of taking them out of little bins and put them in a little Tupperware, because I have big, giant fingers, and so it's really hard for me to get them out. So we got them in this, make it a little bit easier. And so we're gonna be feeding them off to uh, Zazu here. Uh, we're gonna see if Quasi will eat some, the box turtles, the chickens. We got oh, we got a few different animals that love to eat little creepy crawlies like this. So it should be pretty pretty cool and pretty cute and pretty gross to a lot of people I know. Okay, so let's, uh, let's let Zazu out. Zazu. Is not what it is for. Mm. You like those? Yep, apparently we do. Mm. Eating them like popcorn. He's, he's a little scared of it, but. Look, see? We're good, yeah. Yeah. Look at that. So Zazu is an omnivore, so he likes all kinds of different things. So obviously he likes bugs a lot. He loves to eat bugs. And, uh, but mainly we feed him a lot of fruits and veggies. That's kind of his main diet. But as you can see, he does really like the bugs. And that's really important for him as a source of protein. And we also use uh, insects as a very high value treat for him. We're doing training and whatnot. So we're working on like his recall training and having him fly over and land on you like you just saw. Uh, the only thing that really motivates him to do that is, is basically bugs, right? He won't do that for a grape. <laughs> Let's see. No, I didn't even call you. I didn't call you over. Can we go get him? Mm. There you go. Yeah, just throw that dirt all over my floor. That's cool, thank you. So Zazu is extremely agile and uh, he's really good at catching. So I'm gonna see if I can throw one up and see if I'll catch it. Boom. <laughs> Boys, Azu. Yeah. Oh yeah. Just wipe that all over my couch. You gonna go show Cinder? No. Catch. There you go. Mm. Look in there, huh? Azu. There you go. So Zazu obviously loves them, and uh, now we're gonna go see if Petrie likes them too. So Zazu is a von der Deckens hornbill, and Petrie is a redbill hornbill, so they're different species. And uh, we raised Zazu, so as you can see, he's very, very friendly, and uh, he's really cute and kind of goofy. Uh, Petrie, though, uh, Gabby caught. He was flying around wild here in Florida, so he is a lot less friendly. So we're gonna see if we can win him over with some of these. So this is Petrie's aviary outside. He's a lot happier outside. And it uh, looks like he was digging through the plants today. <laughs> Petrie. We're gonna give him a second. To kind of, you know, calm down. Show him what I have. Ooh. Petrie. And he sees it. There you go. He caught it? He caught it. Wow. Good job, Petrie. There you go. You're making friends with grubs. There you go. 
It's good, right? Yum. Oh, now he's interested. So good, right, Petrie? Chris has to stay sto so still. <laughs> mm -hmm. is a very nervous bird. As you can see, he is taking food from Chris's hand. So if you notice, I move very slowly, very deliberately. Keep everything else very still. And he does like them. So I'm sure once we start putting them in his uh, breakfast cups, he'll be very happy. You want some more? He's thinking about it. You're trying to give the parrot one. You like bugs? Oh. Is he eating it? Yeah, he ate it. Really? Oh, Elmo. Parrots occasionally will eat bugs in the wild. You like bugs, Elmo? Lucky likes crickets. You want another bug? <laughs> You're just playing with them. <laughs> So this is our rescue box turtle enclosure. So we have two of our rescue box turtles in here and uh, Basil is in there right now and he's already looking out at us. He's already interested. He's like, I know you guys got food. So we'll see if he wants to, wants to come out. So he definitely likes worms and other little creepy crawlies. So we're gonna see if he's uh, fond of these. understand. Well, they're definitely messy eaters. There he goes. Oh, you got that one good. Making a mess. Well, Sage is very shy, but Basil definitely loves him. <laughs> He's having a blast right now. He's a little glutton, huh? Sage is thinking about it. She's just nervous. I bet if we put some in a bowl and walk away, she'll eat them later. He's a very shy turtle. Basil is not. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. All right, let's go see who else we can feed him to. All right, so now we're gonna take what's left and we're gonna feed him off to the chickens over here. So I'm hanging out, hanging out with uh, Petunia and all the chickens. Before I do that, because it's gonna be utter chaos, we're gonna let you guys know that you can order your own and uh, we have discount code GRUB10 and you can order them on GRUBTERRA, get your own grubs for your own creatures at home or you know, if you wanna pop some of these yourself, I nah, probably shouldn't do that. But, uh, but you can get your own, you know, and everybody's been pretty happy about it. They also send 15% uh, more on their delivery just in case any of them die in transport. So that helps out a lot. The chicken's are already on to me though. Okay, so I'm gonna do my patented chicken call. <laughs> Petunia's like, I want some. <laughs> There you go. They're like, like not sure what to think. <laughs> there you go.
Petunia, you don't want to eat these. Or maybe Petunia would, I don't know. <laughs> so it looks like everybody is uh, pretty satisfied with their, their grub meal today. Everybody's pretty happy. So I want to thank you guys for joining us and leave a comment. Let us know what you think. Hit like, hit subscribe. And uh, if you share the video, that helps us out a ton too. And we'll see you guys on our next uh, episode.